Look at this, I've struck it rich. Gold coins everywhere. Wait just a second, those are pennies. Oh yeah, and it's close to St. Patrick's Day, which means leprechauns or a clever chemistry teacher teaching kids how to take pennies and turn them into brass pennies, copper into brass. I wanna show you the science behind this chemical alchemy, right, to this chemical magic. Here's how they do it. First of all, you start with clean pennies like this. You take some vinegar and uh, some salt and you clean the pennies off so there's uh, nothing on the outside of the pennies. And now we have to coat the pennies. The secret is zinc. This is zinc dust. It's this very fine powder. And that zinc dust in the chemical lab gets mixed with some sodium hydroxide and they actually heat this up and that's how they coat the pennies. So that's where chemistry teachers are doing this in the lab setting. What you get, however, is very cool in and of itself. You could have just silver penny day if you wanted to. Looks like silver, doesn't it? It's actually zinc on the outside of the penny. So we have zinc on the outside and we have copper. Now, if you remember something about metals, if you combine copper and zinc, you get brass, and that gives you this kind of gold look, and you do that with heat. Now, teachers will take and put these on hot plates or in beakers and heat them up this way, but I wanna show you quickly how to do it with, well, a little bit of heat, all right? So watch this. We're actually going to fuse the two metals together. So here we go, let me grab uh, the penny like this, and now heat it up, watch what happens. As you start to heat it up, you can kind of see it start to change. Look at this. Ah, bingo. That's all it takes. Voila, that is how you get a gold penny. You just do that times hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Now, sometimes kids will put these into circulation, and so you always will hear a news story around St. Patrick's Day about a gold coin showing up and the leprechauns doing it. That's just high school chemistry students that are being kind of creative and sharing their love of science. So the next time you see these gold pennies, realize that there's a very clever science teacher out there trying to find the most creative ways to make science fun. I'm Steve Spangler and that's your Leprechaun Science Minute. I wish they were really gold.